guys, Father Gail here, actually in Nashville, Tennessee, I'm at a thing called the SEAT Conference, it's put on by the Fellowship of Catholic University Students. I've been here with 10,000 other college students, like, well, I'm not in college, but I've been here with 10,000 college students, and it's an insane place. I don't know if you've ever seen 10,000 chairs all in the same room, but that's what we got here in this amazing place. I mean, we've been having talks, we've had mass, it's, it's been incredible. You wouldn't believe the massive size of this place. But yet an interesting thing has happened. I've noticed by hearing confessions this week that even in the midst of so many people, in the midst of such a great crowd, so many students, so many young people in our world today are still feeling so alone, as though their life has not meaning. And, and reflecting upon that here in this place, in this empty room, we had to wake up really early in the morning to be here without those other thousands of people. And, and, and the thing that I, I think about, even in, in hearing confessions, is that, is that our Lord Jesus Christ, and, and here, I won't even, I'm gonna take the phone here, you don't know, <laughs> you don't know I'm doing this. So this is, now we got a, a selfie video going on. This is my girl, Tracy, <laughs> it's early in the morning. She's like, wait a second, if I'm gonna be on video, you gotta tell me. But anyway, she's beautiful, anyway. Uh, so, this is my girl, Tracy. And, and what I have to tell these students, what I, and what I wanna tell you guys, is that the beauty of our God is that he loves us so much that even if, if, Tracy, if you were the only human being that ever existed, he still would have come and died on the cross for you. Or if I was the only human being ever existed, he would have done the same for me and the same for you. You're never alone. What a beautiful thing we have in our God who loves each of us so much. Keep the faith. When you fall, get up. Start walking again. Utilize this, the beautiful sacrament of confession. Never doubt the great mercy that our God has for us. And understand that no matter where you're at, no matter how massive the, the setting is, or how many people are around, that you individually are loved. You're never alone.